What is going on my family? Your boy Demetrius is back with another Tekken 8 video. As everybody knows that Tokyo Game Show is not too far away and that is when everyone is going to have their eyes on Tekken 8 including myself because a lot of us are wanting to know what's going to happen when it comes to Tekken 8 as far as what else are they going to reveal as far as gameplay wise, character wise, extra feature wise and all that other stuff. So, uh, you know, so that's what this video is really all about. Just me basically predicting what's going to happen at Tokyo Game Show when it comes to Tekken 8. Uh, Tekken 8 has a pretty good lineup. Everybody's already been talking about it. So I'm just going to put in my two cents on what I feel like is going to happen in Tokyo Game Show. And also what's going to happen when it comes to Tekken 8 in the next coming weeks. Um, I know a lot of people were expecting... Uh, character trailers after Gamescom, but me personally, I don't think that's gonna go down. I think they are done with exclusive character trailers, like they were doing that like once every week. I think they're done with that. I don't know what they got planned, but we would have seen a trailer or two by now, even with the characters that they've already shown. Characters like Steve Fox or Dragon Off or somebody, they're not showing the character trailers, so I guess they're gonna do something different. So in Tokyo Game Show, they're probably just going to just uh, show uh, the next six characters. In my opinion, they really need to go ahead and just show the whole fucking roster at this point. Because right now, they got the whole community pissed off. The whole community is on eggshells right now. Harada just needs to stop being fucking incoherent. They need to go ahead and show the whole fucking roster at Tokyo Game Show. That way... Some of us can be at ease or some of us can start our healing process if we get disappointed on what we see. That's just my opinion. I don't know if they're going to do that, but they just need to stop dragging that shit out when it comes to the roster and just need to go ahead and just, you know, show us the whole fucking roster at this point. Because people are getting sick of wondering what's going on with this roster. Um, so they need to just go ahead and do that. Then what I want them to do, what I expect for them to do also is to show us some more story stuff when it comes to Tekken 8. You know, I don't want them to show no conclusions or anything. Just show us something. Show us like a, a cinematic something, you know, just like a 15 second, 20 second, maybe 30 second cinematic of something going on, you know, with the story, you know, more little interactions and shit like that. That's what I'm really looking for. I'm really looking for some story shit to be shown when it comes to Tekken 8. Because in that Gamescom trailer, they didn't really show us anything that had anything to do with the story except Warong, Mars, and Xiao Yu charging after the Jacks, and that was it, you know. They need to start showing us some story shit. I'm confident that they will do that. Because at this point, the game comes out in January, they could show us something. You know what I'm saying? Uh... Another thing that I'm also expecting them to do, there has been some big rumors that it may be another beta or what they're saying is this will actually be the first beta. The CNT wasn't considered a beta. So the rumor has been that they're going to give us a beta sometime soon, probably somewhere like around November or something. That's just a rumor. I know y'all seen that probably floating around that Tekken 8 is probably going to get a beta before the game's release. So they probably are going to say some shit about that. If they do, that'll be great. Uh, the whole CNT thing. Unfortunately, I was one of those people. I had bad luck and didn't get a code for that shit. So if they have another beta, hopefully we we'll all have access to it. And, you know, we can all try the game out because, you know, only certain people got a code for that CNT. So. And I was one of those unlucky people. I don't know why I didn't get one. I don't know. But, you know, unfortunate. But hopefully we do get another beta or our, the first beta, you know, before the game releases. That'd be cool. And, you know, uh, more than likely, they're probably going to show off some more of that arcade quest mode, which, you know, I'm just not interested in. You know, a lot of people been getting on me about that. But, hey, I I'm just not feeling that. I, I really not. Um. It's just one of those things I'm just not feeling, you know. I rather prefer something like the scenario campaign or something. Hopefully they'll show a new mode or some shit like that. You feel what I'm saying? You know, a lot of people are like Tekken Force or some shit like that, you know. They may do it. Then on top of that, uh, the customizations. Now, I know for a fact they're going to show off some more customizations. Uh, you know, like I said in a previous video, Jun is a character. Like, I really am intrigued 
with her customizations, you know what I'm saying? Because Jun is like that spiritual character, you know. I'm just really interested to see how you can customize her, you know. And also a character like Leroy. Uh, Leroy, of course, is the character, you know, I've been telling people if this shit don't go down the way that I want it and this shit don't go down the way that I hope for, you know, Leroy will be my, my main character that I use. And I would like to see his customizations and see what kind of drip that they put on him with his customizations. They showed a couple of them off in the last trailer. So I know for a fact they're going to show more customizations off. For some strange reason, when it comes to these fighting games, these developers just love to show off customizations, man. It's just, I guess that's how it is in this day and age. You know what I'm saying? But like overall, customizations don't even really phase me no more. Because if y'all be watching me play, I don't even customize my characters no more. It's just, it's that shit, it's just so, it's really old. But a couple of characters in Tekken 8, I am intrigued when it comes to the customization. John and Leroy, uh, to be exact with it. You know, especially Leroy, man, you know. Should just think a fresh cut Isaac Hayes like Leroy, that'd be some dope ass shit. You feel what I'm saying? Tekken 7 came close, but I think Tekken 8 they'll have more shit for Leroy. You feel what I'm saying? And then on top of that, too, maybe you could kind of, you know, really customize his cane. You know what I'm saying? Looking forward to that, too. I know they got some shit for that, too. So, so the customization, that's probably going to be the biggest thing that they show off other than everything else that I'm expecting. Uh, so the customization... I am intrigued by that. But that's all I can really think of when it comes to what I expect uh, Bandai Namco to show for Tekken 8. Uh, those few things right there. Of course, character reveals. I think that's what everybody is waiting for right now. And like I said, I really do hope they just show the whole fucking roster. I think they just need to go ahead and end this shit at Tokyo Game Show. They don't need to drag that shit out anymore. Show us so we can move on from this shit. And then on top of that, stuff like the story. That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for some story stuff, you know. Because that's one of the things I do like talking about when it comes to Tekken. You know, talking about the story. Story predictions and shit like that. So I do like talking about that. So I am hoping that they'll show some deep story shit this time around. So uh, that's pretty much all I got when it comes to what I expect from Tekken 8 at Tokyo Game Show. So, uh... Let me know what y'all think. Leave y'all comments in the comments section below. We can get a conversation started. As always, don't hold nothing back. I will get back at y'all in the next video. My name is Demetrius. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe for the hottest Tekken 8 and Tekken 7 action on the internet, period. And as I keep on saying, ain't nobody doing this Tekken shit like me. And that is facts. I will get back at y'all in the next video. God bless. Stay safe. I am out. Peace.